What's going on everybody? I'm back with another high risk coin buster video for you all today. And in today's video we're going to be doing a four million dollar buy-in and we're starting with four thousand quarters. So they gave us a thousand quarters per million dollars that we spent. So uh, it's a pretty expensive game but luckily they gave us a whole bunch of quarters. However there is one obstacle that we're going to be facing. I don't think there was any quarters in there at all in the machine. There's none on the play field because I can see what looks like the lower shelf through those uh, cash stacks or $20 belt, whatever you want to call it. We're just going to call them uh, stacks of cash. I can kind of see the play field and it looks like there's no quarters on there at all. So uh, anyway, they got this ginormous wall in here. They also got a humongous tower of a $1,000 chips and gold on the pusher. There's uh, two towers of $25,000 chips back there. We done got the one on the uh, right hand side to go. I think that one had a dice on top of it. Same thing for this one right here. You can see that dice. Oh no, and I think we uh, might have lost it to the blue shelf. Yeah, we lost that uh, white dice to the blue shelf. So uh, we might be able to win that back later on. Uh, we'd either have to pay two times original buy-in to get them to put all that stuff into the play field or we could get really really lucky and win a uh, five dollar chip or a red earbud and either one of those two i would get to cash those in they'd put all that stuff into the play field so yeah they got this thing loaded up brilliantly well today though there's tons of cash on the lower shelf like i've said tons of 20 50 and 100 dollar bills oh nice there's a two dollar bill on the right side over there check that out we definitely won the majority of that cash out of there already, which is super, super nice. And let's see, they also got uh, two of the ginormous dollar sign money mister bags They're, uh, on those golden towers out there. So hopefully those are loaded up really good. And uh, let's see, on the blue shelves also, they got like two more mister bags. A uh, purple one over there on the right hand side, a dark blue one on the left, and uh, there's two towers made out of five and ten thousand dollar chips and uh, two stacks of hundred dollar bills on there as well so we definitely have the potential to make quite a bit of money now let's use that rapid fire technique we got tons of quarters might as well so let's get that loot shoot emptied out oh my goodness there's so much cash in here Wow, it was outrageous how much cash is in there. That's insane. It's doing super, super well. Let's go ahead and uh, use that skill stop button. Get a lot of quarters stacked up behind this great big old tower of uh, chips on the pressure. So yeah, all those yellow and red chips, like I've said, those are uh, $1,000 chips. And uh, looks like there's some gold bars at the base of that tower. I think you can see that pretty good. So uh, yeah, the gold bars are worth about two grand an ounce right now, which is pretty nice. There might be a little bit more than that. If uh, somebody wants to, uh, let me know what a one ounce gold bar is worth down in the comments section. I would greatly appreciate that. It's up to you. You don't have to if you don't want to. But I know a lot of y'all are going to uh, look it up anyway, so feel free to comment what it is down in the comment section. Anyway, let's see. I think uh, the majority of this wall right here in the center is going to go this push right here. Come on, big win. Oh my gosh. Wow, we're getting a ton of $25,000 chips. That's definitely where all the big money's at. No doubt about that. Oh yeah, nice. There it goes. The base of this uh, wall right here is starting to go. This is very, very intense right here, y'all. Nice, there it goes, and check that out. There was a mystery bag hidden in there. Wow, that is awesome. Wow, we're going to make a fortune off of this game today. Holy moly. Oh, nice, it's continuing to rain a bunch of chips out of there. All these uh, $10,000 chips right through there are about to drop into the pay. Oh, yeah, that should give us a nice push. Oh my goodness, well that tower just about got stuck against the glass. Did you see that? Holy moly. Well, it all got stuck up front right here. Now those are all $1,000 chips and the gold, it's way back there as well. Oh my goodness, well I was really not expecting that tower to get stuck like that. But uh, it is what it is. We might be able to uh, get it 
all to fall into the page here shortly. So we're about, I guess, halfway through our quarters now. Now let's get that loot chute cleared out again. All right, there we go. Good enough. So uh, let's see. Let's rapid fire a whole bunch more quarters in there. How does that sound? This non-stop rapid fire, the 2,000 quarters. So that right there was about a thousand quarter rapid fire right there. Let's see what it does. Big money. Oh my goodness, nice. We got a gold bar right there. That's pretty good. I have to get a whole bunch more gold over there on the right. It's all on the edge. Now we just need all this money right through here to fall down into the pay. Oh my goodness, wow. Did you see that push right there? That was phenomenal. And we might end up trick-shotting uh, one of these Mr. Bags into the play field. Wow, this is super, super intense right here, baby. Oh my goodness, we're making absolute fortune on this game. All right, let's get that loot chute cleared out. Yeah, it's always best to keep that loot chute cleared out because uh, for the ones who don't know, there's actually this little opening area right up above the uh, loot chute and if it gets too full a lot of times money will start to fall in that little opening space I mean whatever's down there it could be gold quarters and it's big enough for a mystery bag to fit down in there so uh, yeah it's best to keep that loot chute cleared out at all times and if you're wondering where all that money would go if it falls down that little opening space uh, it would actually go to the exact same location as those side slots on the left and the right hand side which, if you've seen the channel before, you'll know that all that money goes to the owner. And uh, I don't get to win or keep any of that money, so... Yeah, we do got to be very, very cautious about that loot suit getting full. Well, uh, right as I'm saying that, it's jam-packed full right now. All those $1,000 chips and gold. So, uh, we'll get that cleared out in just a moment. That's a... Pile up a whole bunch of quarters in there at one time, though. We probably got around 500-ish quarters left out of the 4,000 we started with, so let's get it nice and stacked up in there. So uh, if you're enjoying this episode so far, be sure you hit that like button. Now let's try to get to uh, 15,000 likes on this episode today. I really have confidence in you all that we can get to uh, 15,000 likes. So uh, hit that like button if you haven't already. Oh my goodness, wow, it was super, super piled up. Nice, there we go, that right there is the waterfall we was waiting on. Oh wow, that is awesome. Oh my goodness, now it's just raining tons of quarters. That's what I like to see. All right, so I think our best bet now, because there's probably no way we're going to get these other two pyramids of chips to fall down. I can't believe those are like hovering over the edge right there. Those are literally defying gravity. I have no clue how that works, but uh, anyway, let's see. Let's try to win all these quarters back that are nice and stacked up in there. Because uh, we did win a mystery bag, and that very well could have that $5 chip in there. So, uh... Yeah, we'll open up that mystery bag on camera together, so stay tuned for that. Don't go nowhere yet. We're probably not even a quarter of the way through the game yet. There's still lots more exciting gameplay coming right up. I'm definitely going to want to watch this video to the very end. So, I uh, hope everybody's doing well and having an awesome day today. How's the weather where you all are at? Y'all been getting any rain? I know where I'm at, it's been raining outside pretty hard today, so. And a uh, matter of fact, that's actually delayed uh, this video because I had to stay home for a little bit waiting on the rain to pass before I drove here to play, so. But yeah, luckily, the rain started slacking a little bit and then I was able to stop by here and play this game for you all. This is my first game of the day today. And I am uh, filming this at about like, I'd 
say it's close to 12 in the day right now, so yeah, hopefully I can have this video on uh, here normal time today. I'd like to post anywhere from 2 to 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in the day, but uh, a lot of times that doesn't always work out. Like yesterday, I had a lot of stuff to do, and I didn't even get a winning video until the third game I played, so... I don't think yesterday's video come out until about like 11 or 12 at night, so I, again, I apologize for the late upload. I try not to do that, but I just thought an, a late upload would be better than no video at all. And that video is surprisingly doing really, really well. I think at the moment, as we speak, it's got about, uh, oh goodness, probably close to 25, 30,000 views, so a lot of y'all must, uh, set up and watch that video last night, which I appreciate that, but uh, in case I ever post super, super late, you can always watch the video the next morning or something, or whenever, you don't have to like watch it as soon as I upload it, it's really just uh, what time is convenient for you all, I mean, I completely understand if you didn't want to watch yesterday's video, because I did post it late at night, but uh, I mean, it's still on there if you want to go back and watch it. Matter of fact, I would highly suggest watching that video because uh, something insane happened, and let's just say one of the employees got fired for it. So, uh, I'm not going to spoil too much of that video just in case some of y'all haven't seen it. But, uh, yeah, that video will actually pop up at the end, very end of this video on the end screen. It will pop up on the bottom left of the screen, and uh, once it pops up, you can just uh, click on it and it will take you right to that brand new video. It's not going to pop up right now, but like probably in the last like 10, 15 seconds of this video, it should show up for you, then you can just uh, click on it. You can watch that brand new video. It's about half an hour long, it ain't too awful bad. I think it's like 35 minutes to be exact or something, so yeah, I'm telling you all, y'all are definitely going to enjoy that video. So anyhow, we done got the majority of these quarters out of here, which is absolutely fantabulous. So uh, I'm going to get that loose chute cleared out, separate all those chips and stuff, and then we'll open up that mystery bag together. So we'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. So here's that uh, burgundy red mystery bag. Let's go ahead and open it up and see if there's any nice and valuable prizes in there. Now this one feels like it's loaded up pretty good. Oh my gosh, well, we got another one ounce gold bar. And check this out, we got that $5 chip and a $1 chip. So this $1 chip is worth 500 free quarters. And uh, the $5 chip right here, we'll get to turn this in like I was saying. They'll put every bit of that stuff that is on the blue shelves here into the playing field. So that is absolutely amazing. That Mr. Bag was loaded up super, super good. So I think I'm going to go ahead and cash in both of these chips right here because there's really nothing else left in there to win. So uh, let me cash in those chips and we'll get right back to work. Alrighty, a and coin brusher has returned. Let's get right back to pushing. So I turned in that $5 chip, and they took all those towers that was on the blue shelves, and uh, they put them all into the playing field, and also turned in that $1 chip. They gave me 500 extra quarters, so we're up to about 4,300 quarters now, something around that. So, uh, yeah, that should be enough quarters to... Um, get all this stuff out of here I'd say so anyhow they got a ginormous tower on the pressure back there I'm assuming all those chips back there were the remaining uh, pyramid towers and that great big old wall that was in there oh nice there we go we got both of the stacks of cash to go already well they got stuck in the uh, loot chute let's get them out real quick alrighty I'm back let's get right back to pushing so I got those stacks of cash cleared out of the uh, loot chute yeah, that's the only problem about those stacks of cash. They tend to get stuck against the glass or they get stuck in the loot chute super, super easily. So, uh, yeah, they're always nice to win. It's always nice to see some cash money in there, if you know what I mean. So, uh, anyway, let's go ahead and stack up the quarters extremely high back there on the pusher. Try to get this humongous poker chip tower to get going. Yeah, it's all made out of uh, five and $10,000 chips, and it's got a row of... Uh, $25,000 chips up top, so that's quite a bit of money right there. And uh, let's see, they got the two ginormous tall towers of poker chips on the left and the right. Hopefully we can get those to crash down fairly quick. And uh, they got two golden towers with the mystery bags on top of those. 
So yeah, we should be able to do pretty good on this round right here, I'd say. We just gotta keep on stacking up the quarters super, super high. And uh, we should get all these towers to collapse down in no time. Hope so, anyway. That wouldn't be the best. Oh my goodness, Nos, there it goes. Nos, we got a whole bunch of gold. Let's get that loot sheet cleared out. Oh my goodness, wow. Nos, there we go. That was an avalanche of chips and gold right there, baby. Couldn't ask for a better push than that. And check that out. Uh, I was wondering where the two mystery bags went. They're right there inside of that tower. Oh my goodness, this mystery bag is literally standing up. Look at that. Wow, that is insane. I don't think I've ever seen one do that before. So yeah, that's four more mystery bags in there. There could be uh, dots in those. I'm really, really hoping there's some more special chips in there. Like the uh, $10 chip, $50 chip, or the $5,000 slash $10,000 chip. Yeah, that uh, 5,000 slash 10,000 chip, that would be worth one or more free towers made out of five and 10,000 dollar chips. And uh, let's see. The $50 chip, we get to turn that in at the very end of the game. Uh, they'd take anything that has fallen down in the gutters, they would put it back into the playing field. So yeah, uh, hopefully, hopefully a lot of that stuff is in there today. That would be amazing. Oh my goodness, wow, jackpot baby. We scored big on that one. John Lima's tower on the right just fell backwards. Oh my goodness, well that loot shoot was super, super full. I don't know if you just now heard that, but it sounds like money uh, fell back inside the machine. See, that's what I'm saying. That loot shoot, you always gotta keep it cleared out or you will end up losing some money. So, uh, yeah, hopefully that $50 chip is in there today. That would be amazing. And uh, that $10 chip, that would be worth one or more free bonus towers. See, what they'll do, they'll let me spin a wheel. We win that $10 chip, and that wheel has uh, different types of chip values on there. And uh, gold bars is one of the options also. And uh, we get to spin that wheel, and whatever it lands on, that's what type of brand new towers they'll put inside the machine. So... Yeah, hopefully if we do get that, we can get $25,000 chips. That would be amazing. So, yeah, we've already made a ginormous profit from that uh, $4 million buy-in. So I'm going for a new record win today. That's what I'm going for. So for the year right now, I am down around pretty close to $1 billion. I mean, I'll make my money back, then I'll end up losing it again. But, uh, yeah, that's usually how it goes. You end up losing a lot more than you win at these, and I've definitely lost more than I'll ever win back. So uh, just to throw that out there, I've definitely lost more money at these than I'll ever win. But uh, anyway, if this is your first time watching my channel and you're enjoying this super, super amazing video right here, and you want to see more videos like this one every single day, seven days a week, uh, be sure you hit that subscribe button, enable the bell icon, that way you're notified for future uploads. And, uh, yeah, hit that like button, too. It would really help out the channel. So, yeah, if you subscribe and enable the bell icon, uh, you'll get a pop-up on whatever device you're watching my videos on. Could be your phone, iPad, tablet, anything like that. Uh, you'll get a pop-up every single time I post a brand new video. And, uh, like I was saying, I post videos typically every day anywhere from 2 to 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so yeah, don't miss out on these amazing videos. There's different types of videos each day. They're all coin pressure videos, of course, but uh, yeah, there's different types of towers, different buy-ins, all that good stuff, so stay tuned for more videos. Hit that subscribe button. And uh, my goal is to get to 200,000 subscribers by the end of this year. So if we can get to uh, 200,000 subscribers by the end of this year, I will try a $2 billion buy-in. I still need to do a $1 billion buy-in. I've been putting that off for a very long time because I'm just too afraid to do it, to be honest with you. Spending $1 billion, it would have to be like, jam-packed full with towers before I'd ever do that. 
so yeah let me know if you'd want to see a one billion dollar buy-in we really really need this mister bag right here to get going so let's see should we go ahead and pile up that right side with quarters yeah let's just put this remaining uh, basket of quarters in there we got to get that loot chute cleared out and stuff anyway have to uh, separate all the chips from the quarters and stuff because uh definitely don't want to be putting chips back in here and i've had people ask me before if i could like put chips back in there and try to win the towers and stuff and the answer is no because uh that's definitely against the rules here at this location i don't know about at other places but i know for sure here it's definitely against the rules so uh i mean if you accidentally throw a chip back in there like if i accidentally uh forgot to take a five thousand dollar chip out of the basket that the quarters were in or something i accidentally put five thousand back in there then uh there's no problem at all accidentally doing that because like i mean they would give you a refund if you called them back here but uh, if you're sitting there throwing handfuls of chips in there then uh yeah that would not be okay here at this location All right, well that right there was the last of our quarters. I feel like this mister bag right here might be like stuck against the glass. You can kind of see something round right here. Do you see that? Well, I can probably see it better than you all can. But anyhow, let's go uh, round up the quarters right quick and we'll continue pushing on this right hand side and try to get this ginormous tower. So we'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. So before we get back to pushing, I would like to go ahead and open up all three of these mister bags right here. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and start with the purple mister bag. Now let's check it out and see if there's any nice and valuable prizes in there. Now, I must say, this one feels pretty heavy, which might be a really, really good thing. So, let's see what we got. Nice. Check this out. We got a whole bunch of $10,000 chips. Now, let's see. That's eighty grand and $10,000 chips right there. I'll take it. So, that's pretty good right there. So, now let's uh, move on to the uh, dark blue Mr. Bag. Yeah, this one feels like it's loaded up pretty good as well. Not as heavy as the other one. So, let's see what we got. Hopefully a lot of good stuff. Nice, check this out. We got the $10 chip. We also got two more of the white dice and a golden dice. So the skull dice, we'll get to roll that, whatever it lands on. The gold will multiply by that number. And uh, like I was saying, the white dice, we'll get to roll those, whatever they land on. My winnings will multiply by those numbers. That is absolutely magnificent right there. Yeah, that Mr. Bag was loaded up super, super well. So now let's move on to the uh, ginormous dollar sign Mr. Bag. Yeah, hopefully this one's loaded up pretty good also nice check this out so we got uh two more of the one dollar chips so that's another thousand quarters we could really really use that right now and uh, we got three more of the white dice we got another gold dice and a silver dice so that silver dice that'll multiply our quarters by uh whatever it lands on so that is absolutely fantabulous so uh, let's get right back to pushing let's try one more round try to get that humongous tower over there on the right hand side i really really think we can get it we just got to uh, keep it pushing over there on the right. While well, the quarters around it are going, that's for sure. And there's still some uh, chips over there on the right corner we got to win also. Nice, there we go. Got a whole bunch of $5,000 chips on that push right there. Nice, there we go. That was a good push right there as well. Yeah, those are defying gravity. Look at that. That is insane. Nice. There we go. We got them. So, uh, comment the number four if you've made it this far into the video. I'm only going to say that that one time just to make sure you're still watching. Because I know a lot of people fast forward and stuff. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, comment that number if you heard me say that. Yeah, I don't know what to say about this tower over here. Well, I definitely think we need to go ahead and stop right here because I barely have any quarters left and I want to be sure we have enough quarters to uh, win everything out of there today. So I'm going to go ahead and turn in all those $1 chips. I think there was uh, two of them. And I'm also going to turn in that $10 chip and we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, we're back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I turned in that $10 chip and both of the $1 chips. They gave me a thousand more quarters. 
and I got to spin that wheel and today it landed on $10,000 chips. So that's one away from the best possible chip value. The best one would be $25,000 chips. But uh, it seems like most of the time whenever we win that $10 chip, it either lands on uh, gold bars or $1,000 chips. So $10,000 chips is absolutely exceptional. So yeah, we should definitely be able to make a fortune off of this uh, bonus game right here. So uh, hopefully there's another special chip hidden inside this mystery bag right here. We just won it. fell out of there. And uh, that golden tower that was like on the right... I guess they moved that further back a little bit, but it's already in the exact same place that it was originally in. So, uh, hopefully we can get super, super lucky and knock down that gold tower. This tower's getting pretty close to going also. So, uh, let's see. Should we go ahead and rapid fire a whole bunch of quarters in there at once? Now, we definitely have a boatload of quarters now. Like I said, we really needed those extra quarters. Now, turn in those, uh, two one dollar chips. Gave me a thousand more quarters, which is nice. So, uh, I know it looks like I win at these machines every single day, but trust me, that is not how it goes. Just uh, take my word for it. I definitely lose a lot more money than I win at these. And uh, like I said yesterday, I had to play two games before I would get the winning game. Which the third game I played was the winning game. The first two games that I played were losing games. And uh, the first uh, two losing games put together, I was down like close to $20 million. So, yeah, that just goes to show you that you can really, really lose a lot of money. So, yeah, that John Lomas Tower on the Crusher. I mean, technically, all three of the towers are close to crashing down. I'd say we might get the one on the Crusher to go first, though. Or maybe this one, who knows, we'll find out in just a second. So yeah, I don't suggest any of y'all ever play these machines. Because you can lose a lot of money. That's no joke right there. You can lose millions of dollars. And uh, see, I started off with like the smaller buy-ins, like $100 buy-ins. Oh my goodness! Nice, there we go. We just got both of the poker chip towers to go already. That is absolutely fabulous right there. Matter of fact, that was fantabulous. Fantastic and fabulous mixed together. Wow, this is doing exceptional. Alright, so that was the rest of the quarters that I had in that basket. We still got a bunch more sitting on top of the machine up here. So uh, yeah, this video might be a pretty long video today, possibly about uh, half an hour long, 40 minutes long, who knows. I mean, I try to shorten the videos down as much as I can. See, like right now, uh, the camera says I've been playing for uh, 3 hours, 19 minutes, and 4 seconds. So yeah, we've been playing a decent amount of time. And uh, most of that will be edited out, I'd say. Like, to this point right here, the video for you all is 27 minutes long, 25, 26, 27 minutes long. That's just uh, my prediction. Oh yeah, this is doing super, super well though. We're getting a ton of uh, $10,000 chips. Yeah, it won't be long we'll have the whole entire machine cleared out. There's really not that much left in there to win. Just uh, two gold bars. And uh, all this right here is maybe like 70, 80 grand. Still quite a bit of money though. So. Alright, let's get that loot chute cleared out. It's getting a little bit piled up. There we go. And uh, we still got that one mystery bag we got to open up. So there could potentially be... Another special chip in that mystery bag that we get to cash in. We'll see here in just a second. Oh nice, we got ten thousand bucks right there, ten grand to go. Let's get it. So yeah, like I said, if we can get the fifteen thousand likes on this video, that'll be amazing. And uh, 
you know what if this video can get to 15,000 likes within uh, 24 hours of it being uploaded tomorrow I'll go ahead and do that one billion dollar buy-in if we can get to 15,000 likes so I'm leaving that up to you all it's totally up to you all to get me to 15,000 likes but uh, every single like helps if everybody would uh, team up we could get there really really fast and uh, these videos have been getting anywhere from uh, 20,000 to uh, 60,000 views in a day. If like the first 15,000 people who watched hit that like button, then uh, we'd get to that 15,000 likes in no time. So it's 100% free, it's not costing any money at all. And it will just be rewarding for you all, because uh, tomorrow I'll do a $1 billion buy-in. Oh yeah, that last chip, it's making its way toward the edge. Well, it's already on the edge. It's just those corners are pretty difficult to push at times. It's because of those uh, side slots on the left and the right side. If there's any weight or pressure built up on these corners, the quarters like to just take the easiest path of travel, and that would be down the gutter, of course. All right, so we got it all cleared out of there. That is absolutely magnificent. So, uh... Let's go ahead and open up this mystery bag right here. Like I've said, they tie the strings pretty tight on these. It's kind of hard to get them open at times, so let's check this one out and see what we got. Oh my gosh, wow, check this out. We got another $1 chip, so that's another 500 free quarters, so that's pretty good right there. We got the mystery money keychain, so this is super, super exciting. This can be worth $1 all the way up to a billion dollars, and the white dice will multiply the value of this, which is incredible. And uh, let's see, we got uh, three more of the golden dice and two more white dice. So that's pretty good right there. We made out like a bandit on this game. No doubt at all about that. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call them over here. I think we have won 15 dice in total. We got nine of the white dice, uh, five of the golden dice, and one silver dice. So they'll put all 15 of them dice on the pressure back there. And we got to roll them on down to that lower play field, whatever they all land on. We're going to get to multiply our winnings and our golden quarters by those numbers. So let's call them back here and we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, AMD coin pusher has returned. Let's get right back to it. So this right here is definitely the most exciting part of the game and it's the scariest part of the game because you don't know what the dice are going to land on. Oh nice, well that was a perfect start right there. We got a, a six on that first white dice. So that right there was a... Uh, oh my goodness. Well they're doing super super well now. We're going to get a multiplier winnings and our gold by a whole bunch potentially. Oh nice, we got a four. But uh, the two dice that landed on ones in there, I think that silver dice landed on a one right there and that one gold dice. Uh, just pretend those don't exist, the ones do not count at all. So let's try to push as far left as possible cause those dice are making their way toward the gutters. All right, so I definitely think we're gonna go ahead and stop right there. Literally all those dice landed on pretty good numbers so I'm going to count everything up, multiply our winnings and our gold and our quarters by all of that right there, and I'll let y'all know how much money we have made today from a $4 million buy-in. We'll be right back. You all are not going to believe how much money I've made today. This is absolutely outstanding. I ended up winning $15,762,135. That is the chips, the cash, and that mystery money keychain all put together. And uh, the value of that Mr. Money keychain was uh, $70,000 today. I forgot to mention that earlier, but uh, now you know. So anyway, all the white dice totaled up to 37, so I'm going to get to multiply all that by 37. And in total, I ended up winning $583,198,995. Wow, I am absolutely shocked right now. I was not expecting to win that massive today. Oh my goodness, I'm literally shaking right now. This is just insane. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe we've made that much money today, especially from a $4 million buy-in. That is just insane. So one thing I have noticed, they've been putting way more dice in there uh, recently than they used to, So which is... That is an amazing thing right there for sure that they've been putting that many dice in there. So anyway, that is a ginormous, humongous, life-changing win today. Absolutely mind-blowing. And uh, moving on, we won 57 ounces of gold. 
and uh, the gold dice totaled up to 14 so I'm gonna get to multiply the gold by 14 and in total I ended up winning 798 ounces of gold today and uh, the spot price of gold is like $2,030 an ounce I think so that means we got an extra $1,619,940 in gold that is absolutely fantabulous right there and uh, last but not least we ended up winning I believe it was 3000 555 quarters and uh, that silver dice landed on a one unfortunately so we won't get to multiply our quarters by nothing but uh, let's go ahead and divide that by four just to get the dollar amount that means we got eight hundred eighty eight dollars and seventy five cents in quarters that is absolutely marvelous right there so uh, anyhow that is not bad not bad at all for a four million dollar buy-in so if y'all enjoyed today's episode be sure you hit that like button and uh, consider hitting that subscribe button and turning on the post bell notifications. That way you get notified for whenever I post a brand new video. So uh, anyway, if you want to check out a whole entire playlist of my videos, that will appear at the bottom right of the screen. And if you want to check out yesterday's video, the video I was telling you all about earlier, uh, that will appear at the bottom left of the screen there. And uh, if you want to check out one of Coin Pusher's videos, that will appear at the top left of the screen there. He's got a good channel, so check out his videos. And uh, if you want to hit that subscribe button and check out some of my other videos, you can click that button at the top right of the screen. So with all that being said, I'll see everybody on the next video. Y'all take care and have an exceptional day.